What's up guys, I just wanted to follow up on my Halo 5 Guardians Truth video and let you know I still have Halo 5 and today I broke it out, I was going to go over how to get the most out of the game if you're stuck with it like me. Although you'll never get Halo 5 to aim like all the other true Halo games that had perfect aim, you know, you can at least do this and I recommend you set up your controls at a aiming sensitivity of 5 and an aim acceleration of 3 and then go to your dead zones and make sure you put those at 0. Or as close to zero as you can get them without any kind of wobbly camera when you're standing still you know free aim like that is not good but you definitely want your dead zones on zero if you can get it that way and anyway it's still not going to fix the aim they need to do an update and fix it make it one to one aim so that you aim left and right at the same speed as you aim up and down because right now you don't and that's what's throwing you off on halo 5 so hope you enjoy the video and it helps you out so go down, you know, hit the start button, go down into your settings, your controller, and I prefer aim sensitivity of 5 with the default buttons and thumbsticks. I like inverted aim. Uh, you see I messed around with the look acceleration for a while I had it at 5 and I found it feel better at 3. Um, so go down to your dead zones, your inner and outer dead zone, make sure you have those at 0, as close to 0 as you can get them without any kind of movement on the screen. Which is so let's field test and see what happens. It seemed to help a lot. I was getting a little more headshots. It's not, it doesn't aim like Halo 4. It doesn't aim like all the other Halos like Call of Duty uh, or Destiny. You know, all those game types are the game and controls. So check this out. Got him. Reverse. That one is my favorite gun, obviously. Of all the guns you can start with. Oh, my favorite gun on the whole game is the rail gun. I like that. Got the guy off the warthog. Definitely helped a little bit with the aiming, like I said, but. Not perfect. I like that turnaround headshot. So, there we go. Here's where I was uh, showing the differences and acceleration. This is the acceleration on 5. Then I turn it down. Turn it down to 3. And it just felt better. Felt like I could do more precise headshot aiming. I don't know, you guys should experiment with it a little bit, but... Well, I guess we can just hope that the free DLC will be good, and like I said, you know, try messing around with your settings from Halo 5, and good luck with the controls, guys. Don't be fooled into thinking buying an Elite controller is going to make it handle like the old Halo games. There's something done wrong with the programming, and they need to do a severe update to fix it. But until next time, I hope you guys have a good time gaming and follow Attic for Realsies. I'm on Twitch, YouTube, Twitter. Thank you.